Mike Cardano with Roto Experts and the Fantasy Sports Network here with you on this Monday, April 14th. We're just two weeks into the season, and we've got Miguel Cabrera and Andrew McCutcheon owners hyperventilating. Relax. Going into last week, Ryan Braun and Bryce Harper owners were panicking, and just one week later, viewers have done an emotional 180. Now we've got just nine games today with a 60% chance of rain for the Pirates-Reds game in Cincinnati and some possible snow, believe it or not, in Milwaukee today with the Cardinals in town. So be sure to check your lineups before first pitch. Now the Rays are in Baltimore today and there may be a perfect storm brewing. Now the weather should be fine, about 69 degrees and overcast, but Ben Zobrist is 10 for 23 batting 435 in his career against Wei Yin Chen and he's locked in at the plate, hitting a pair of two-run home runs yesterday. Zobrist is $3,700 on FanDuel, but I love him over at DraftKings, where he's just $4,400 with the higher salary cap, providing you with great flexibility qualifying at both second base and outfield. In his first start in place of the injured Jacob Turner, Marlins left-handed starter Brad Hand gave up a three-run home run to Bryce Harper along with three other hits and two walks in three and a third innings. Now, Harper has remained hot at the dish since his first bleacher reacher of the season. After a slow start, Bryce now has 10 hits in his last six games with at least one hit at each. Harper is just $4,600 on DraftKings today and $3,700 on FanDuel, and there are 16 other outfielders priced higher on each site. With Harper's price suppressed because of the lefty-on-lefty -lefty matchup, I'm going to pounce on this one, looking for results similar to last week. After being swept by the red-hot Milwaukee Brewers, the Pittsburgh Pirates are a team searching for offense. The Pirates total just five runs, striking out 26 times in the three-game set, and I've been loading up on the opposing starting pitchers in Daily Fantasy, taking advantage of Pittsburgh's anemic output during this stretch. Anyone who had the Kyle Loesch play last night knows what I'm talking about. Now, Pedro Alvarez is over his last 10 with five strikeouts. Sterling Marte is just two for his last 12 with five strikeouts, and Andrew McCutcheon is not exactly in fuego in April, hitting just 233 on the season. Now, Homer Bailey has certainly got off to an auspicious start this season with two awful starts against the Cardinals. But Bailey didn't get to pitch much this spring because of a groin pull, and I'm looking for him to hit his spots in his third outing tonight, taking advantage of a reeling Bucks offense. On FanDuel, he's $7,600 in the second highest priced pitcher on the board. But on DraftKings, Bailey is just $8,100 with six pitchers demanding higher premiums. Bailey is priced for success in this one tonight. Someone asked me this past weekend if it was a valid strategy to place a low-priced bench player on your daily fantasy roster in an effort to pay for a particular pitching matchup that you wanted. Actually, in some instances, it is, particularly on a site like FanDuel, where you lose a quarter of a point every time your batter makes an out. Now, if he doesn't end up getting up in the game, you may be avoiding an 0 for 4 and a minus 1. Or if you're keen and you pick up the right player, there's no law against that player contributing just because he wasn't in the starting lineup. The so next time you're looking to scrape up some cash to fit in a certain pitcher, go ahead and try that strategy on for size. Now, for more daily fantasy coverage, tune in weekdays to the Roto Experts in the Morning Show with Scott Engel and Adam Ronis from 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time right here on the Fantasy Sports Network or on Sirius XM Fantasy Sports Radio, Sirius 210 XM 87. And for you West Coast folks, we replay the show here on the network during your 6 a.m. to 9 a.m. time slot. And weekdays from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on Sirius XM Fantasy Sports Radio, we've got the first word in Daily Fantasy with coverage from Dr. Roto and Tony Sincata, along with Daily Fantasy industry heavyweights Drew Dinkmeyer and Mike Leone, and some of the most well-known Daily Fantasy players in the space. So tune in for that. And the Fantasy Sports Network iPhone app is now out. Yeah, that's right. You now get the live television feed streaming on the go. So go check that out in the iPhone App Store. Good luck today in your daily games, everyone, unless, of course, you are matched up head-to-head -head or in a tournament against me. And in that case, I apologize in advance for taking your money. I've got three kids, and I need to take care of business. But remember, it's not personal, it's just fantasy.